Don't forget to subscribe to Steven C. Killer. Now get back in the grave, gutbag! What's up, everybody? Steven C. Killer here, bringing another card opening video. Now, this one is an extra bonus one because of a couple reasons. The newest set is out Universal Onslaught. And I ordered a couple boxes. But it was supposed to be delivered today, which is Saturday the 15th, and no, they're not delivered until Wednesday, which sucks. So I will have an opening uh, some point in the next couple days, so if you guys want uh, to check that out, subscribe to the notification bell. I did do an opening of the last one. I did say I wanted to open another one of those boxes, but I'm not 100% sure if I will. I did just buy a couple of boxes of the newest set of the Universal Onslaught, but when I was at my uh, near uh, Target today, I spotted something special. Now, if you can't tell from the thumbnail or not, I found a couple of these containers from Assault of Saiyans. So as you can see right here, it shows something unique, uh, Event Pack 4. Now that's one thing that caught my eye is because this is a if you I don't know if you can read it that well it says not for sale on top so these packs that are normally not to be sold are being sold at Target and it comes with four booster packs and one promotional pack which kind of interests me it could treat it intrigued me to the point where I was like you know what not bad pricing because they were like ten to eleven dollars or something four packs that's not bad at all and I bought three of them so we're gonna open up uh, we're gonna open up 12 packs plus the bonus one so technically 15 packs but the, the other three don't only come with I, I'm assuming one card yeah one card per pack um, and I'm interested in how these ones uh, come out so if you guys did not see my uh, openings of Assault of Saiyan on my channel I have been very lucky and I pulled the secret rare I wanted I wanted this guy when he first came out. Beautiful looking card. Gorgeous. Fucking out of the nowhere. Just. I was upset with the the, uh, the third. I think it was the third booster box. Yeah, the third. This is one that came out of the third booster box. And I was so happy when this guy uh, came out of one of the packs. Then uh, this was actually out of the first booster box uh, I bought. And I was pretty happy. So. Can't go wrong there. And then I bought some random packs, and I was able to get the gold mine of this of that set. This Vegito. So as you can see me in the reflection, <laughs> as you can tell, I am pretty well off from that set. I cannot complain. I love this set. There are still um, two other signature cards I could pull uh, that I do not have. I would love to pull. Um, I did pot. I did think about buying the signature of Gohan. If I don't pull him here, I'm probably just gonna buy him. I'm not too rushy on the signature with the trunks, uh, but prices have been fluctuating on on the on this set. So over time, things get cheaper as you as as I bust into these packs. So let me get things uh, underway and uh, crack right into these because of packaging. But that's just regular scotch tape right there. Well, hopefully this is not a bust. But the other packs seem okay. This, I'm not okay with. This is possibly damaged. Like, look at that. Look at that. Ooh. Worth or not worth? That is the question. Maybe I'll be in the title. Are these worth? We'll see the, we'll see the uh, damage of this card. I don't even know what can come out of these at all. Um, but as you can see now that it's out of the packaging, what does it say? Right here. Can't really see it, but it says not for sale. There you go. So, overall, already I'm a little bit worried that, but you know what? It's an experimental video. These were really cheap packs, and I can still use some cards. I'm actually going to open up that one first. I'm going to open this first. So let's see. Giving me a little trouble already. The slit is not letting loose. 
Do I have to get my knife? Fuck! Just from the slit. There we go. I don't want to damage the card pre opening it if to show if it's already damaged now are these worth getting I don't know what cards I can get out of this but it is from event pack 4 which I think are the ones that you can only get at like tournaments or something I'm not sure let me know down below if you guys know where this is from so let's see what damage if there's any and what card I can get out of this Nani? Okay. Just seems like a holographic world piece. I don't see much. Actually, it's not damaged. Uh, well, it's a little warped. It's a little warped. The card itself is not damaged. It's not a bad looking hollow. It doesn't have a stamp. And it's an uncommon. So... Oh wow, it even has the not for sale on the bottom, if you see that. So I don't know how uh, how they're selling these non for, not for sale packs, but there we go. First pack we're gonna open is the one I'm a little bit skeptical on, which is this one that has actual scotch tape on it. Okay. Does not look like it's been opened. Looks like it was just taped down for convenience on the packaging. Alright. <clears throat> I doubt these ones, like Pokemon cards, have been uh, possibly weighed or anything. Alright, so well, you're wide open, which is another solid looking card. Some of these cards look still amazing, um, and they are, and there's still quite a few SRs I did not pull from the this set that I wish I did, um, and I can't remember exactly. I think there's a Cauliflower one I didn't pull, which I think there's a Super Rare back there. I can kind of tell because of the gold, uh, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, Trunks, my Son Goku, and ooh. Oh, Dependable Brother Son Gohan. Um, not bad. I don't know if I pulled this guy. I think I have actually. And of course, there's a, quite a few SPRs. Um, I would hope uh, I wouldn't mind pulling an SPR out of these packs. Um, and of course, if the if a signature card is pulled, that's even better. Um, or Secret Rare. There's still the uh, the Raditz, Vegeta Raditz, and Broly card. I believe it's. Broly, Raditz, and Vegeta, Super Saiyan 3's uh, Secret Rares. I never pulled that card. It's not going for a lot. It's like it's like a $50 card now. But it'd still be nice to pull. It was super. It was more expensive when it first came out, but it dropped by a lot. So let's see. We got Dormant v Broly, Kami, Chaozu, Hidden, Abyss and Zamasu, Shaman, Trunks, Trunks, uh, Sun Gohan, Sun Goten, Brotherly Bond. That's still an awesome looking card. Uh, helping uh, Bulma. Ooh, we got a reverse uh, Zamasu. Nice. We got a regular rare um, Raditz. Like I said, these were honestly a, not a bad deal. I was just curious if it was worth or not worth. Let me know down below, guys. Do you think these packs will be uh, these packs were worth for you? If you would have bought these for about twelve bucks, um, let me know about down below. A lot of these cards have dropped massively in price, um, but you know it's still fun to pick some cards up and open them. I don't do too many openings. Ah, oh, this one is a nice card. I think I got this one or a different Rosé uh, Reverse Hollow, but this one is amazing. I love this card. If I get this Reverse Hollow and if I didn't have it already, I need to check. Uh, oh god, Zeno. <laughs> Krillin, Bond, Namekian, Zamasu, Gohan, 
trio. Wait, trio? Why does this? He said trio Sun Goten. What the fuck? Trio. Oh, whoops. I read that wrong. That confused me. Oh, last resort Vegeta, and we do have a card behind it. Oh, it's a uh, Super Saiyan Trunk. <laughs> we got both SR versions of the signature cards we'd want to pull. So, we got another SR with a regular rare in front of it. I was hoping, I was hoping we got something big. But, you know, with these newer sets, they, they do have more of a troll because now with um, the chance of pulling something with a rare in front of it, not being just exclusive to a really major high pull, there's always that chance. So let's get into this one. And let's check it out. Originally when I bought these, I was gonna open uh, a booster box and these on the stream. But because the booster box is late, um, I decided I'll just post this as a video as its own and uh, just enjoy the booster boxes. Cause that new set looks so amazing. And I'm just excited for it because of a lot of the potential it has. Ooh, we got another rare. And what is it? Oh, shit. I didn't pull this guy. I fucking forgot. I actually do not have this card. Out of all the fucking ISRs, I did not pull this card. This card is worth I call that a fucking win. I did not pull this Goku um, at all in the two or three booster boxes I opened. Yeah, I opened uh, I opened uh, three booster boxes of this set, which is usually my limit for per set. I usually only buy at most three boxes. Box number two. And this time the Kel and we got a Kel that's taped up. Gohan, Zamasu, and another Kale and Caligula. And of course this one. This is going to be an interesting one. What can we get? I wonder, is there anything on the back? So we can get Silence, Bulma, uh, North Kai. We got the, oh, we got the World Peace. It's an extra. We got the only extra. All the other ones are battle. Hmm. Paragus the sacrifice. Okay. So it looks like we only get like what? Let me see. Looks like it's just like uncommon and common hollows. Honestly, I did not know what this was gonna be from, or is this like from a uh, promotion? Uh, like I didn't know what type of promotional card. I thought this was going to be similar to like maybe some dash packs or something, but I know those are getting a little bit tougher to find. Nani? We got World Peace again. Don't tell me we're just going to get that. Uh, if we get triple World Peace, suspect. And of course, we're going to take care of the one that's taped up first. Okay, so. Super taped up. Holy crap. Look at that. What the fuck is with them? Look at this shoddy scotch tape right there. Alright, well, hopefully the cards are not damaged. Especially if it's something great. Alright, unexpected turn. Mess, uh, Krillin, Vados, Shaman, Zguasu, Trunks, Trunks, uh, Piccolo, Mai. Ooh, we got a Reverse Kaba. Uncommon. And we got a Beerus Flickle God. That actually shot, uh, like scared me because I saw the blue and yellow. Um, and I, I had to look back at it because I thought for some reason... I thought I I misread or miss saw the hollow and I thought I pulled another one of these. <laughs> Not gonna joke, that would have been amazing freak out right there, cause I was like, wait a second. I see the blue and yellow. But no, it's a troll. 
Love that. Open these packs all the time. Uh, Kefla's Fury. I pulled this card reverse, I think, twice. Uh, Denial of Hope. Goku Black. The This one, I think, is the one I actually got uh, reversed. I'll have to find it later just to confirm which one I had reversed. But Shaman, Gawasu, skip the card. Yamcha, Coco. Oh, oh, what was that? Son Gohan, Trunks, Betrayal. Oh, that got me again. But we got another SR. Med uh, med uh, I cannot say that word. It's a Vegito SR, which honestly, this Vegito SR is fucking still badass. It's not worth much, but it's super fucking fire looking. And I would love to pull the SPR version of that. Um, I think the only SPR version that, I, uh, to my knowledge at this point in time, was worth is um, probably the Kaioken Goku, I think. Um, but I could be wrong. Alright, Unlikely Duo, Demigra, Bloodline, Kale, Powerball, Videl, Chaozu blowing up, Kaoken Goku, Vegeta, Trunks, Mai, and ooh, the Champa and Bottos. This actually might still be a good bit of change because I think this last time I saw this was still possibly close to a $10 card. And if I'm wrong, I'll put it right below because I think this one is actually worth a good bit of money. It's very playable. It's very strong. It's 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 still in a meta. So, back-to-back -back SR pulls. Holy crap, that's really good. We're getting almost two S... It's almost been like two SRs uh, per, uh, per container. That's not bad. The rates of these... Solid so far. Alright. Broly, Kefla, Kami, uh, Namekian, Magetta, Monster, Double Sunday, Goku, Weak Point, Kale uh, Kalifla, uh, Trunks, and. Oh, yes! This is the one I was just fucking talking about. The Kaioken Sun Goku, Defender of Earth. Yes, SPR. Holy shit, yes. Dude, this one was so good. And I think this one is probably one of the best ones I could have pulled SPR. It looks so nice and crispy. I don't have this card. Oh yeah, this was worth. Alrighty, right now, right now. That is what I'm talking about. So far, box number two. It's hitting strong. Alright, come on. Something other than World Peace. If we get World Peace again, something tells me World Peace was very, very highly uh, produced. If this will let me open, thank you. Oh, well, that car just got fucking damaged, probably. Nani? Oh, it's a Vegito Blue. On Spiron Super Saiyan Blue Vegito. Uh, whoa, that's... That's nice. I didn't actually damage this, did I? No. Okay. Holy crap! That card is gorgeous! I don't know how much this one is, but if there is a price I can find, I will put it down below underneath my face. Oh my god, that card gets asleep instantly. I'm I, No offense to the dead... Or the revival of fucking Krillin and Roshi, but this. I 
I just love the color. Like the hollow with the rainbow and the splat. That is a unique looking fucking card and I love it. I never seen this card. Oh my god, we are putting that in the pile of hits. Right away. I don't care what it's worth. That card looks nice. Okay, so let me grab the the taped one once again. This one is actually taped more, better, just straight in the center instead of like the other one was taped all around, which sucked. There we go. See, that's that's a little bit nicer at least. Let me flip that around. There we go. All right, let's see. Can the uh, the luck continue with this one? You know what I want? I want a fucking secret rare um, Goku Black Rose or Murzumasu or something. Ugh. Well, actually, technically, I already have a, uh, a a secret rare with Zamasu in it. But all right, Goku Black, Broly, Raditz, Krillin, Universe Six, Elder, Hit, Extended, Hit, Son Goku. Uh, we got Choppa, regular rare, and we got another super rare, regular SR, of Vegito. Trick me again, you motherfucker. And as of right now, I am pretty satisfied with my pulls. With that SPR. Yeah. And that, uh, that other Vegito. And the fact that I got that Sun Goku. Those three... So far, those three, I've gotten one great hit in each of them that I enjoy now owning. So, Son Goku, uh, Son Goku, Magetta, Bond, Cyberman, Ooh. Yamcha, Kaba, that's not the same Kaba, Great Ape, Toki Toki, Trunks, all too easy, we got one thing behind it, and it is... Hey, we got the Kel, uh, Kefla one. She just got announced for uh, Fighter Z too, so that's not a bad pull either. She's not uh, she's not super valuable or anything, but she's not bad either. Um, I think she's like maybe a dollar, if anything. So if if it, if it's over two bucks or something, uh, I'll definitely try to put the uh, the price below in editing this. But if it's not, it's not worth it. Like, a dollar's kind of even pushing it. So, let's get into this. We'll leave the Zamasu and Goku Black for the last. Let's get through this one. Hey, we got Merge Zamasu. <laughs> they still show up in this last pack. Alright, Unlikely Duo. Mass Replication. God, that's such a good looking card. Uh, a squad, Namekian, Shoutsu, Monster, Trunks, Zamasu, Goten, Hit, and our first time in a while, like, just a regular rare. We didn't get too many just packs with regular rares in it. That, that's fine. This is, this has been super good. Oh, I love opening these packs. I can't wait for the next set, though. I can't wait to bust into those packs. Oh, the first failure of opening the packs. Ah. Wow, this pack really wants to fight. Oh my god, this pack really wants to fight. Okay, I think I've opened it enough so we can probably just tilt and pull out. There we go. What the fuck? There's markings on this card. Well, hopefully it's not something amazing. Vegeta, Goku, Zeno, Kale, Shaman, Megeta, Namekian, Trio, Gohan, 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 and we just got a regular Fuse Zamasu at the end. Not not bad. Okay, we got we got two we had two duds back to back, but you know what? That's not bad. Let me know which one is the best for you guys. Because I feel like I know which one's going to win. But we got in the first box, we got this Goku, which is a win. This Trunks, 
this reverse, and this Gohan. Put these to the side. Decent pulls to the side. Then we got in the next box, we got we got this reverse Kaba, this Vegito, this Chompo and Vados, which is probably worth a little bit of money, and this. These two probably are the highest valued cards I've pulled. And this Kefla, Vegito, and this extra Vegito, all inspiring. And I just fucking, yeah. Out of all the cards I pulled, these are my four favorites that we got. Because, yes, because of cost, it's not a bad card to pull. I did not have, I did not have, I did not have any of these three right here. These were the best of the best. And I am just overjoyed to actually have this card now in my collection too. This card right here is a solid looking card. It's like classic Kaioken gold goodness. With Gohan and fucking Krillin in the background. This is just an, I just, yes. Never seen that one. That one's worth. All right guys, let me know which one, uh, what, which one you think is worth. Me personally, I'm already saying number box number two. Because that came with two giant hits. Alright, so if you guys enjoyed this content, and look out for the uh, uh, booster box opening. Like I said, I bought a couple of those booster boxes. They should be here sometime Wednesday uh, the f 19th, I believe. So yeah, sometime after the 19th, I'll be opening uh, and, make, and posting my video on that. So look out for that. I may stream opening one of those boxes. And if you guys want to try to catch the stream, if I do... Uh, and or whenever I post the videos, you guys know what to do. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Links down below for all my social medias like Twitter, Patreon, and Discord. Links down down there. So thank you again for watching, and until next unboxing and or unpacking, I'll see you later.